All right, welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Final Fantasy VII Remake. Hope you all are having a great day today. Uh, yeah, so let's resume where we left off. Been absolutely loving this game, guys. Having a great time. Uh, we just got down to the slubs. We fell through the roof. We met up with Flower Girl again. And uh, <clears throat> we don't know the fate of our team. We uh, fought that boss and we fell, somehow survived. And uh, yeah, let, let's keep it going. But again, if you guys are enjoying this, hey, just smash that like button. It's the best way to let me know what you guys want to see more. And uh, yeah, so this is Flower Girl. I forgot what her name was. It started with an A. All right, let's get this rolling. Really? You will? In that case. Huh? I'll see myself in. Thanks. Mm. And who are you? He's my bodyguard. And a soldier. Pretty cool, huh? Huh? A soldier? Ex-soldier. Well, what do you know? You've got the eyes, at least. You don't mind, do you? Bodyguard work's not too different from Merc stuff, right? Huh? Uh, I guessed. From the sword. Just do this for me, okay? Fine, but it'll cost you. A lot. A lot, huh? One date ought to do it. Huh? Huh. Well, you're weird enough to be one. What class? <laughs> First. <laughs> if you're gonna bullshit me, at least try to make it believable. <laughs> <laughs> Watch the flowers! You heard the lady. <laughs> I'll make this quick. You better. Body. <laughs> you know I'm first two fights. Really? Throw her. I'm like, why does this feel weird? This is the first I've heard of it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I'll be okay. <laughs> Here we go. Try me. So long. Hey, go. Little help in your guys. All good. Ready. That it? Enough. Here we go. Enough. Okay. Little what's his face? Oh, I'm damn good at it. It's fast. Wow, be careful. Get ready. Any time. No holding back. What you waiting for, Bob? Here we go. Any time. Let's do this, Bob. Step in. Come here, soldier boy. I don't mind. All right. Let's do this. Here we go. Well, okay, then. Sloppy. 
I'm super low health here. Trying to get in there to get that. Obviously, it's not that We're simple. Well, the music is pretty epic in this game. Through the attic. Maybe we can get out that way. Right. Through that hole. Uh, we'll be playing Seven Days to Die. Um, southern on the channel at some point. I've played it a little bit in the past. Huh? They saved me. Come on. They're not blocking this door anymore. Is 
Okay. They want us to go upstairs? Could be a trap. Scratch on her, you're done. Sir! We bring her in, in one piece. <laughs> what now? <laughs> Run! <laughs> Move it, I'll shoot! Oh no, you won't. But sir! <clears throat> Could drop that. Can't leave now. She needs help. Okay. What's the hold up? I can't get to her. Huh? Some kind of magic trick. Okay, I see it. I'm like, why the hell can I go? to heal real quick. Should we pursue? confused on what these things are. Especially since up to this point they've been quite hostile. Arc will be on the main channel. Yeah, guys, you gotta remember, um, I'm not doing any grind on my main channel anymore Here. because it's just the series has fallen off so much. So any of the grind is being done on the second channel. Prep for and uh, we got a lot of grind we got to do to get ready for uh, King Titan. So that's why there hasn't been any art content on the main channel right now. They gone? Yeah, I think so. 
What are they? I think... actually... I don't know. Let's just go. Okay. Up for crossing the rooftops? See that pillar over there? There's a station right by it. Shall we mosey on over? Let's. So, what's next for you? A little bit of bodyguard work. <laughs> right. After that, we'll saw how you doing. Sector 7 slums. Uh, you today we're going to be playing to this and GTA. Yep. Of course you do. That suit from earlier. He was one of Shinra's Turks. What's a Turk want with you? Don't know. Hey, don't Turks keep an eye out for potential soldiers and stuff? They do more than just scout for candidates. Turks get called in to handle all kinds of situations with extreme prejudice. <laughs> Professional bad guys. Gotta love them. Back to my question. So what's he to you? Looked like you knew each other. Maybe he thought I could be the greatest soldier yet. Forget it. Hmm? She's definitely you holding know? out on us. surprised if you had it's honestly kind of I'm playing Diablo 4 well, I've never played a Diablo game before um I am thinking on early access or for if you pre-order the game you get access to it tomorrow uh, but I've never played Diablo before so I don't even know what to expect wait give me a moment come on lady you did way more hardcore than this little ass jump the words of a soldier candidate so petty how many love interests does my man cloud have in this game we already we already got my man dedicated to tifa though so No one live in these buildings? Nope. No one to get mad if we make noise. Looks kind of rusty. I'll go first. It's pretty old. Be careful. Okay. <laughs> Easy now. You worry too much. I'm not some princess who needs to be coddled. Shit. Thank you, Cloud. Huh. Ah, there it is. The wall. You know, I thought about leaving once, but in the end, I couldn't. Too dangerous? Too much. A whole world bursting with life. Maybe more than I can handle, I think, sometimes. Even now. People hate the steel sky. The slums, but I don't. How could I? All that passion, all those dreams, flowing and this blending looks together. Looks like a junkyard. Something greater. The slums even worse than the other one. They do got a nice church, though. Can't count on you to wait. Sure about this? See for yourself. Hmm. Maybe I'll go on ahead and leave you all by your lonesome. Just ah. maybe you shouldn't talk. Then you talk. Tell me a story. 
Not for free. Cheapskate, you're... Ah! 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 Gotcha. You're killing me here. <laughs> here goes nothing. Just gonna be dirty as hell now. Look at that, not one stain. That's impressive. You good? Of course. Cloud's Never pretty smooth with it, with chat. That a compliment? Uh, not really. <laughs> Thanks anyway. So she joined the party, chat. We're getting closer to the station. Even so, we'll probably run into a few monsters on the way. Hmm. Huh. There's a face that screams, so what? Eh. Is it bad that as soon as I seen that phrase, she joins the party, I just instantly was reminded of Stranger Things? Alright, so I don't know what she's all about, so let me see here. She comes with her own... Give her the bulletproof chat. Oh, she already had ice. Use the refocus limit break. It can only be used once per battle. I wonder what that is. So I got power up. Might steal that from her and put it on cloud. We'll see how str what, what her fighting style and shit is. Arcane Ward. So we're gonna we're gonna try to mess around with her, see what she's all about. Not scarier things when I sleep. Where are you going, Cloud? Damn lady, I was trying to adventure, man. So yeah, split. When it comes to games like, like, uh, out, Civ, I I I don't mind turn based. Uh, it's great combat games. I'm not a huge fan of it. But even like the little bit of turn based stuff they have in this, not really turn based menu. So it's really not bad. Both powerful offensive and support spells and uh and is effective in multiple roles. Hold down X to deliver a continuous stream of magic attacks. These combos can uh, target multiple en enemies over a wide area. <laughs> oh, so she's like a range. This one's for range. you. <laughs> You'll see. Yeah. Someone looks like they're in their element. Okay, so her normal attacks, pretty meh. Good range damage, but 
Barrett's range damage is still better. I've got this. Don't you mean oh, that AoE spec is nice though. <laughs> Down Y to focus your magic energies and release. Oh shit! Okay. Yeah. Sorry, but I gotta. That'll do. <sighs> Go on. So, Cloud, you don't know the slums that well, do you? Compared to you, no. Training grounds, barracks, battlefields. That's the world I know. You sound proud of that. <laughs> Yeah, she's got some decent AoE damage. Ha ha. We poured so much of our blood and sweat into building that reactor. Now I can't believe this is happening. If you would all just please calm down. Hey, what the hell's going on? Check it out, Come Mom. on. There's no need to shout. Popular place. Yeah. Well, it's got a good view of the reactor. Show. They know that. Don't worry. Oh, didn't expect to see you here. Huh? Um, yeah. Oh, on your way home from the pit. Well, I'm glad you're okay. Did any debris hit the church? Not debris. No, that's something at least. But you may not be so lucky next time. It was a cloud that hit the church? Cool ass looking dude. Another Turk. A real man on a mission. On the hunt, more like. For me or you? Don't know. Don't care. Then let's stick to the back streets? Ah. There will be monsters. Better than Shinra. All the fatty flavoring calories you need to get you through the day. So are Turks like soldiers also? There's a Shinra dump site up ahead. Not the kind of place anyone would ever choose to hang around in. Great place to lay low. It's a different role. They've got the run of it. Enough. That's it. If it's 
No telling where they'll come from. Monsters instinctively target weaker prey. Mm. You'd better watch out then, Cloud. <laughs> Guess I gotta. <laughs> I'm coming! Okay. Shot. Really weak to magic. Get ready. So long. But she she did monster damage to those dudes. That way is a dead end. They were doing some construction, but quit halfway. Turks are kind of like CIA black ops. So are they? Are the, are the Turks technically like stronger than soldiers? Then are they like on a higher level? A sec. Yeah, um, Cloud said something about Turks are the ones that go hunting for soldiers, like soldier candidates, so that's why I just assumed that they were a higher. didn't work. Maybe it's broken? Pretty sure this path we're on loops around too, so... Hmm, wonder if we can move this. the stronger prey. Turks are like Black Widow. Still a fair ways off. Well, we did take a detour. Getting tired? No. Nah. Me? I'm feeling a bit hungry. How about you? Amazed. You're in for a treat when we make it back. Don't have time for that. You'll want to make time for my mom's cooking. And that's the final word on it. We'll get home quick and eat ourselves stupid.
place is terrible. Easy. That's Soul Drain. What? That shit was strong as hell. Uh, yeah, it's not like an, I wouldn't say it's open world. It's more or less uh, like a lot of areas that you can like travel to and walk around. But yeah, it's definitely not like open world. Is there such thing as an open world Final Fantasy game? Damage to the fire attack, man. Let's go. So watch out for that guy. They, uh, they explode. But yeah, it all depends on what you people can consider open world, you know. Um, look, in my definition of open world, I look at games like, you know, Red Dead Redemption, Fallout, you know, like full-blown open worlds where you can kind of just go wherever, whenever. These are more like hubs. Like, if I wanted to, like right now, I 
couldn't go back to another t city or another area. Like you're, you know, you're you're kind of locked into the hub at that moment. So that's what I would say. Uh, free, I would say free roam is a big part of open world. Like if you can free roam the world and go anywhere you want at any given time, that's what I would classify as an open world game. You should be the healer. I, I, I got to swap her out. How much met MP? She actually has a lot of MP. But Cloud has a decent bit right now, too. No good? That sucks. I see. We got to go up. Drop or push the thing back. See her real quick. So I got her built for magic. She has a heal on her now. Also, I was fighting her without any upgrades. So now she's upgraded. So now she, she, she should be set up for magic pretty good.
Anderson, I'm good, nice brother. Work. Way to think ahead. Yes, we're home free. No need for thanks. I'd rather get paid. Hmm? You're getting paid right now. Hmm? Huh? Be able to relax a little now. Don't forget about the turps. Ah. Could come at us any time. Ah. Keep an eye out. So, do you think this means another war's coming? The Sector 5 slums are right there. Oh, so this is the actual Sector 5 slums. So that area that we were in was what are they watching? an outlier area, I guess, with the hey. church. I've never played Humble Beast though. No, this is the first Final Fantasy game I've ever played in my life. I've never even seen anything from a Final Fantasy game until this game. While fallen beams and other debris continue to hinder Those rescue efforts, the fires to appear to have war. been mostly extinguished. So if we catch the bombers, we get a reward or something? Uh, that's the director of Shinra's Advanced Weaponry hey, Division, isn't it? Uh, excuse me, ma'am, but would you mind answering here. a few questions? No. Uh, They're targeting reactors. No uh, can you give us any updates on the status of the reactor? So, what what the kind of damage did it suffer in the explosion? Are we in any danger? Uh, Mako Reactor 5 has been temporarily shut down, and all fires have been successfully extinguished. The situation is under control, and the people of our fair city need not worry about any additional complications. Johansson the right there, chat. Conducting a full a forensic investigation, but we suspect the device used was similar to that employed in the attack on Mako Reactor 1. The perpetrators of that atrocity were filmed making their escape. These agents of the eco-terrorist group Avalanche are currently believed to be in Actually, hiding somewhere in Midgar. For the watch, like and uh, given wonderful. that this group has now Let's attacked two reactors together. in quick succession, can they really be stopped before they strike again? What do you think? Uh, well, uh... <laughs> Have no fear. I'll do anything Shinra will army. keep Midgar safe. Okay, time's up! All right, let's there go. There could be a war any day now. Why the hell would anyone do that? Without the reactors, how are we supposed to live? We need to stand up and fight against anyone who tries to... Man, I can't decide what oh, I want what timing? Mind lending me a hand? Place is really hopping, huh? Nice side effect of the train really situation. So, what do you say? I'd love to, but... Maybe we kind of want to try that. Exactly. Wasn't there a final? There's a Final Fantasy MMO. I think I own it. I help out every now and then. It's fun. Eris. Well, well. What are you doing all the way up there? Was trying to get a look at the reactor. Who's this guy? This is Cloud. He's a mercenary, and currently my bodyguard. That's Oats. See you. Yeah, little dude. Two peas in a pod. Uh, Aaron! So, what are you guys up to? We all went to see the reactor. Oh, that's right. You're supposed to come by the house. Uh, what for? I don't know. You're just supposed to. Well, guess we have a new destination. I should probably explain. The Leaf House is the local orphanage. That's where all these kids live. Hey, Aerith, where'd you go? The church again? Next time, we should all go together. Why, hello, Aerith. As popular as ever, I see. 
Apparently, but they sure keep me on my toes. <laughs> uh, better than being bedridden. Thanks again for all those herbs. You've helped a lot of people. No problem. Anytime. How'd you manage to find so many anyway? <laughs> oh, I have my ways. And him? He's my bodyguard. Just until I get home. And you're sure he's up to it? Hmm. Maybe. Since I'm so generous, I gather medicinal herbs for his patients sometimes. Here's the leaf house. Damn, she just said, fuck that stool. Someone told me that talking to them. There you are. We're back! And we brought Aerith with us! Sorry to make you come out here. Don't be. It's on my way home. Well then, I hope you won't mind me asking for some flowers. No problem. How many? All you can carry. What with all the doom and gloom we've been hearing on the news recently, oh, I thought some just... flowers might help cheer everyone up. I'm sure they will. Like, hey, just grab me a couple, yeah. As much as you could possibly wash carry. Up before our meal. She's wearing that dog though on her skirt there. You see that dog? Is that not a sign of the resistance? Hey, Mister, do you want one of these? So, Cloud, what's your favorite flower? They're all the same to me. Huh. You sure you want to say that to a florist? Better than lying. Okay. Then what'd you do with the flower I gave you? I, uh... You give it away? I did. Ooh, to who? Tell me. Don't recall. Hmm... And what? my man Cloud keeping a secret? Thought you didn't like lying. <sighs> well, anyway. The Cloud's a player, man, isn't he? My house is just up this path. Mom should be home by now, so I'll introduce you. There you go. That's my house. It's amazing. Yeah, this shit is mad nice for the freaking slums. Come on. I'm home. Hey, baby. Been up to no good? Rude came by. This is my mom, Elmira. And this is Cloud, my bodyguard. Uh, hi. Take good care of her? That's my job. <laughs> or was my job. Yep, thanks. So Cloud, you gonna head back to Sector 7? Yeah. Then I'll show you the way. <laughs> then why'd you have me bring you here? What if the Turks show up again? It'd suck, but I've dealt with them before. Honestly, I'm much more worried about you. What if you get lost, huh? You'd be too embarrassed to admit it, and so you'd just keep on going. Quit acting like you know me. Hey, Mom. I'm gonna go take Cloud over to Sector 7, okay? <sighs> okay. But why not wait until tomorrow? If you head out now, it'll be dark when you get back. Better to rest up here and make the trip first thing in the morning. When you'll have daylight to spare. That's true. She's got a point, Cloud. Hold up. Oh, yeah. I still need to deliver some flowers to the Leaf House. Since we have a little time before dinner, you should come with. That wasn't the deal. You mean you want more? Even though you've got a priceless reward coming your way? Do you know what I promised him? I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go grab the baskets. Be right back. <sighs> that Aerith. She's a handful, isn't she? It must be tough. To... No, never mind. Hmm. The game trying to get me to, to not stay loyal, chat Aerith to won't be long. Tifa. Well, my loyalty is unshakable, guys. 
see how we turned down Jesse. She didn't promise Cloud the cheeks. Hmm. And if she did, we're like, we we go upstairs. Explore your house, lady. Huh. They really do got a nice little spot here, though. Yeah, my man ain't even holding it on his arm like she is. He's just holding it in his hand. That's how you could tell he's upset. When he's just... You gotta rock it like a purse, my guy. That's the manly way to hold a flower basket. Hmm. Which ones do you think we should pick? Any of them. Oh, don't be like that. I know you have an eye for this kind of thing. Good eye. People used to give these to declare their loyalty to one another. Interesting, right? I mean, it's a master flower picker. He picked one flower and it turned into all them I flowers. Think we still need a few more. Which should we pick next? That's the one I gave you. Huh. It is? Nice try, mister. You can't fool me. She said, as many as you can carry, so maybe a few more? No, screw that lady, all right? That's not how you do business. Not when you're doing a favor Whoa, for somebody. Tales, huh? I gotta hand it to you. I never would have thought of that. It'll definitely take them by surprise. I think we're good now. What do you say? Shall we go? Yeah. I mean, my man's doing a consistent curl right now, so we gotta hurry up before his arm gets tired. under the gun or anything i'm not cut out for this crap sure you are and when you're done you'll be drowning in job offers so how do you think they'll arrange these flowers don't know well we'll soon find out wait out here oh okay but I might be a while why not check out the town I wonder if they have a weapon trader here Did 
Animal can move. What'll it be for you today? Weapons vendor. Let's see, do I have anything I could sell? I wonder if I should start selling this crap here. Yeah, you could sell all this. Materia. Be a good upgrade for Barrett. No weapon, so. See you soon. Clouds are softy. Here's the Sector 5 Community Center. Midgar wouldn't be Midgar without the plague and the reactors. What, was that the sound that, uh, what's it call it, was making Barrett? Da 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 da. Ba -ba 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 Wanna join the watch? Finally got power. So it's not safe up there. Oh, this oh. I remember you. Where's Aaron? The leaf house. Hey you little shit. Is something wrong? You could say that. Sounds like someone spooked the kids. I'll go yeah, stab them. Two of them disappeared. They ran away after this creepy guy wearing black clothes showed up. A Turk? That's what I thought. But no. It's this guy who's always stumbling around town in a dirty robe full of holes. They say he's sick or something. Oh, and he had some kind of number tattooed on his arm. Eleven? I don't like the sound of this. I'm gonna check it out. I know someone who fits that description. I'll come with. Okay. Come on. He heard about what happened. Come on. I know this place is off limits to grown ups, but if we want to rescue them, well, we gotta break the rules. Oh, you're back. 
pirates come to help? Yeah, leave it to us. We'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters out there! Don't worry. I've brought a super strong friend along with me. I used to be a soldier. So where's the guy? I don't know. <laughs> Clap and make sure you do that in for the kids. Him. Right now, let's worry about the Used to be a kids. soldier. Come on. You guys have got to hurry and flower. find our friends, okay? Uh, what if they're eaten by monsters? They ran off this way. Be careful. Yeah, I'll talk to them when I get back in. Where do you think they went? Who knows? They're kids. I haven't been assassins shit Nothing though. To do but look all over. I just hope we find them in time. Bring it. No <laughs> holding back. Go on. <laughs> Allow me. It's on you. I'll take care of them. Hang back. <laughs> It's over. Get ready. Enough. Go on. <laughs> Nothing to it. Guys, thank you. Dude, we got 200 likes on the stream. I do appreciate it. Try to stay behind me. That way, I can cover your back. Here we go. <laughs> just, just go. Get him. That's it. Yes. Sorry. Not bad. Uh, Q Delta, how you doing? Ah, oh, there they are. And they're not alone. These things are bigger looking. It might just be from. And yeah, we gotta fight one of them robot guys. Leave this to me. I don't think so. <laughs> That's bad. You're mine. Get ready. Enough. See ya. Get him. Any time now. Attack hits different, chat. Sorry. Oh. Quickly, we gotta save them. All right. Get him! That's it! 
Get ready. It's your turn. Let's do this. Go on. <laughs> Keep it together. So it's my turn? Need more magic. Tagging out. Taking over. Here. Hey. That's that. I'll take care of them. Get him. No escape. Hurt yourself. That was actually a pretty good play right there. Yeah, she just healed for 1,700. With Kira, though, what... And I think her heal might have upgraded. I don't know if hers went up to rank 3. That's no, still in rank 2. Hit with that. Grow up to be a soldier. You gotta work at it. Cloud thinks I'm good enough to be one, right? Look at you, Mr. Popular. That was so cool, you guys. Especially that. Oh, yeah. yeah, it was really cool when you went. Like 
Uh, well, yeah, you know. like that. I'm trying to think, guys. I, I don't know why. As a kid, I've seen somebody type Xeno Gear in the chat. I remember as a kid, there was a PlayStation 1 game. It came in one of those like real thick cases and it had like, I don't know, it had like freaking four discs to it. And I remember it was like red the cover was like red and white, and maybe it's even black on there. What game was that? Was that because I never played that either? It was like two discs or something like. Was that Xeno Gears? Tifa. Tifa? What's wrong? Nothing. Is Tifa like your girlfriend? No. Hmm, but she's someone special. It's not like that. More like... I don't know how to explain. I see. Why are you up with my business, lady? We just met. Well, what do you think? Do I have what it takes? Thank you. From now on, if you run into trouble, promise me you'll find an adult, okay? Okay, I will. And here, since you're so cool. Pay out, you little kid. You guys are both grown-ups, but you're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. So she has the mithril armband. Yeah. Everything. That's a big up in uh defense, but she uses loses a lot of magic there. Titanium bangles actually we only yeah let's swap to that. We only lost a little bit of uh like one magic or one defense and gained a bunch of magic defense, so Don't worry, it'll be okay. Oh he's the cool guy. <laughs> Wait! Tifa knows him. Hmm. Not him. It looks pretty damn similar. Huh? There's the number. But why two? Who knows? Come to <laughs> The reunion. <laughs> Cloud, get it together. Come on. You don't know who Sephiroth is, do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? 
I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. Maybe they did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. Come on, let's go. Oh, then you must be from the legendary... Hey, Cloud! Legendary... I know a lot of people around here need help. When I'm out on patrol, a lot of them tell me about their problems. Do you think you might be interested in helping out? Well, I'm all for it. We still have plenty of time. I'm on the clock. <laughs> That's a kid wearing. Don't worry. I give you permission. Us. I always have the latest information. Come find me if you want to know. Look at this little kid. <laughs> oh my! Is that a Moogle? You can see me, Koopa? Then you two must be very, very special people. In that case, welcome to the Moogle Emporium. I'm the owner, Moggy. You must not be familiar with Mog the Moogle. It's a pretty well, famous fairy tale. I'm fucking Mog familiar. Mog wanted to bring happiness to all the Moogles of the forest, so he decided to open a shop of wonders. That's right, Koopo. I open a store to bring happiness to the slums, like Mog. And you know, only people with the purest of hearts can even see Moogles. Uh, are you talking about me? Well, Moogle magic isn't perfect, Koopo. Anyway, we've collected all kinds of rare and wondrous goods. They can be yours if you've got enough Moogle medals. But you'll need to buy a membership first. If you find any Moogle medals, you can spend them here, Koopa. So, Moggy, what do you do with the medals we give you? Oh, you know what? I use them to make everyone happy. That's the duty of every Moogle. Of course, just like Mog the Moogle. Good. You better have, like, the coolest shit in the I world for sale. I working hard, Mr. Merc. Yep. So what are you gonna do next? Keep on working hard. As you always do, I'm sure. You know... This is how I earn a living. Huh? Really? I thought you were just doing it for fun. I suppose some people do. Hello, I'm some people. Nice to meet you. Good to see you. Now, I know I found a lot of those Mo Moogle medals. Oh shit, this kid's got the juice, guys. I don't have any Mugle medals. Leaving already? There's a lot of problems we can't fix because we're just kids. And that's where you come in. I thought that trader was gonna be terrible, but he's he's actually legit as hell. Oh, I had twelve? What? What the hell was that zero that I seen? Turn that music Welcome down. To the this is so loud. Oh, that was the. I don't know what the hell that is. It was kind of. I, I wanted to see how much the staff cost. You know, is the staff only two medals? This book seems so good. You guys are great! Thanks to you, I've got a ton of medals, Koopa. Which means I can bring happiness to a ton of people. Good for oh, you. the graveyard key? Hey, Cloud. I think I might have spent Maybe all my points, Maybe say it though. like you mean it. Not until I'm happy. Go on, work your magic. Make me smile. From ear to ear. I'll need a lot more medals, Koopo. Well, that won't do. Come on, Cloud. Let's go get more. Good luck, guys. 
All right, so I got her a new staff. use any of those so we'll hold off so I spent points on that it has way more magic damage look at that 60 compared to 43 that's huge well, now we just got to get the um, materia in it Opens up a slot. Still got to get that on cloud. Figure out what the hell that even does. The reinforce. Does it? What does that do exactly? Is it like a power up, guys? That reinforce. Uh, yeah. Says use the re refocus limit break. Must be busy, but I hope you haven't forgotten about my research. Oh, of course not, hello. kid. Cloud has been assisting me with my research and development. Ooh, that sounds fun. Count me in. One moment while I run diagnostics. Huh. How very strange. You don't appear to be in my database. And that's bad? There must have been some sort of server error. Oh well, any friend of Cloud's is sure to be of great help. That's not bad for strength. Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Cloud, I have the most amazing news. I believe I might know how to develop summoning materia. Something heretofore thought impossible. Scientists say that this materia can only be found in nature, but I may just be able to prove otherwise. And so, Cloud, I turn to you. I would like to test this theory by way of my combat simulator. To wit, I want you to fight and defeat summon data in VR. I sense that you find my phrasing to be somewhat obtuse. 
Deadly has developed the new combat simulator VR missions. As you gather more and more battle intel, special missions allowing you to battle summons will become available. Talk to... Oh, shit. Please let me know when you have made your preparations. I want to battle a summon. I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new materia. Shiva? Defeat Shiva. Then I invite you to ready your portable battle simulator.
feeling good. <laughs> Shiva summoning materia is complete. And now it's yours. Use it as you see fit. The Lady of Frost is the perfect companion for a man like you, Cloud. She will prove most useful when the time comes to destroy Shinra. He was a hell of a fight, guys. I look forward to receiving all of So I'm gonna go ahead and put her on. Hmm? Oh, hey. Should I be great if they asked us again? I don't think I know you. You don't look Go for it. Oh. You're that former soldier, aren't you? Cloud, was it? Former soldier turned problem solver. Are you okay, Miss Folia? You look upset. Uh, yeah, I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Patrols? Is that a leaf house thing? Something they do to help out? That's right. In return for the donations we receive, the kids go around town picking up litter, running errands, that kind of thing. I don't suppose you've seen any of them, have you? <sighs> you see... I have some important plans this evening, and I really need to go and get ready. Would you like us to go round them up? Oh, that would be wonderful. There are five of them out on patrol right now. They all wear homemade swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. Hitting us with the fetch quests over here. For Emma Mota quests. You're back. Look what we've done with the flowers! Lovely, don't you think? Great job! That's wonderful! <sighs> Isn't it? Oh, I nearly forgot! I saw some Shinra suit walking towards your house a little while ago. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. Get back to class. Broke the Mako reactor, and there's gonna be another war because of it. Is that true? Who knows? But isn't there something else you should be worrying about right now? <gasps> I forgot about Miss Folia's lesson. I gotta head back to the house. I know. You're talking about. <sighs> At least these kids are easier to find than the damn. Uh, hey there. How goes the cats patrol? Were. There's a lot more people on the streets than usual. Maybe because the reactor blew up? Well, you've been keeping a very sharp lookout. But... Don't you think you're forgetting something important? Oh! Miss Foley of Lessons! I gotta get back to the house! Did you know? This place is I just love Hey there. How goes the patrol? Great! I've been picking up garbage and giving people directions. Plus, I helped an old lady cross the street. You've been busy. These side quests didn't exist in the original me. game? Gotta really? Work hard. The house depends on people's donations. Oh no! Yeah, we equipped Shiva. I gave it, I put it on. Did you uh, see Miss Folia? Is Earth. she mad? Oh, I gotta go! I'm sorry! Sure. Hi. 
must have been on the Hello, Cloud. Sir, it's a real honor to meet you. I think you soldier guys are awesome. I want to be strong and tough when I grow up, too. You sound very determined. These are dangerous times. A reactor blew up and a bunch of kids lost their friends and families. Who knows what might blow up next? I guess that means more children might be extra to the XP house though. That's why I don't mind knocking out some of these little the small side quests. A, a little bit of extra XP. Speaking of teachers, Miss Foley is looking for you. Oh man, I completely forgot. I have to get back right now. Hey, any marks around? Shinra weapons are on the rampage. Five of them, like floating eyeballs. I saw them wander off into the scrap, but if they come back into town, it'd be a disaster. We need someone who's willing and able to fight. Sure hope not. I'll handle it. You will? Oh man, you're the best! I could hear them shouting intruder detected or some other nonsense when they floated off. Be careful, they look dangerous. Sure hope not. So do you think this means another one? I've been out here all night. Listen, one kid. Sure hope not. Did I just shut up? Shit, that bridge. You mind taking a look? Get your hands on the hottest duty. That's what's called easy. I'm sorry I forgot about the last one. I don't know if you know it. Oops. Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. Don't take it personal. <laughs> you Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. No need to get rough! You know! Damn, 500 damage in a single hit? <laughs> Try me. Gotta get a little payback for my partner. Come on then. Burn. Burn. <laughs> Calling fire. You're going down. Yeah. Soldier, huh? First time. Ah! Go on! Joke. Go on. Time to burn. Okay.
Too bad. Wind attacks. Okay, so he's weak to wind. I don't have any wind. To charge of the kick. No, okay, we're gonna go cross slash. Oh my god. Then think about changing careers. Oh, too early. Get ready. That's pretty strong, isn't he? His counter attack is insane. No, no. Deal with that. So it's my turn? <laughs> Can't keep eyes open. Well, did he just put How's her to sleep? Back working out for you? Um, oh. I have smelling salts. Expect. There. Yeah. Yeah. That was pretty I nice. See. <laughs> You'll see. I thought you didn't want to well, this dude is no, a real deal, man. But this is self-defense. Sorry. Go on. Yeah, what the? Back to good now. Get ready. Yeah. Can you take over for Let's me? Let's do this. Don't overdo it. I'm coming. One more shot. Good. You can do it. My turn. I'm behind, but... Deal with that. I can't. Let's do this. Here. Gotcha. Keep it together. I'll show you what I can do. Uh, tagging out. My turn. Stop it! You're not really sucked. Go on! <laughs> Keep my distance if I were you. Give it up. Not looking good. No escape. Well, I don't know how the hell you got. Maybe just gotta block it, but I tried to block it before and it just hit me anyways. Got him. Please, just leave us alone. You know I can't do that. Hey there, partner. I'm sure you're having the time of your life, but we're needed on standby for a job at something about Sector 7. So get your ass back here now. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Be 
It was a good fight, though. We had a, I had to keep flopping back and forth. them really close. I'm trying to learn all about the business. You want to open up a shop of your own someday? Yeah, so I can earn lots of money and use it to help the house. The teachers don't like to talk about it, but we know the donations aren't enough to keep things running. Uh, but that's a secret, okay? I'm not supposed to tell anyone. Anyway, I gotta go study. That's everyone. Let's go back to the house. Hold on, lady. <laughs> Hold on one sec, guys. So now we gotta head out and clear this. These, well, what are they? I think he said they were uh, robots, intrabots. Yeah, I think I need to equip her with some more magic attacks. I wish I had wind. I don't have any wind. Arcane Ward. I think I have that on. I had Arcane Ward on uh, Barrett, I believe. But we don't have to go this way. The VR kit sounds wind. I might have to go check that out. 
Oh, what the hell is that? Do some fucking damage. Best do it right. They're resistant to physical attacks until pelted with magic, okay? Time to burn. Get ready. Take the lead. Here goes. Trouble here. Get him. Everything's spinning. Can you handle them? Let's do this. Yeah, I'm like, yo, why can't I use my shit? Is that not all of them?
damn it. Well, those things are quite hard to fight. I got down on the ladder, and I was in her dress, and the whole screen just turned white, guys. Now we know what's underneath. <laughs> grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new materia. Here it is, wind. Battle Intel submissions. I really like this. The children finally came back, thanks to you two. You've been a great help. Okay, everyone, come inside. It's time to hit the books. <sighs> you guys, the Toad King's back. I saw him near the hideout. We gotta do something about him! The Toad King? A weird, creepy monster we've seen near the hideout lately. He wears a crown and walks around like he owns the place. If he's not a king, he's gotta be monster royalty at least. I bet a soldier could beat him up easy. Oh yeah, real easy. But here's the thing. I don't work for free. There it is! Or cheap. 
But we don't have any money. Sorry, kids. The watch wouldn't ask for money. But if we ask any other grown-ups for help, they'll find out about the hideout. And that'll be it. We really don't want to lose the The kid really hideout. hasn't nailed Come that on, yet, but the nails are oh, all going and inwards. And we'll give you some cool treasure if you do. And if that's not enough, I'll pay the rest of your fee once I open my shop. Well, if you won't help, then we'll just have to kill it ourselves. Guys, thank you. We almost got 300 likes on the stream. I really do appreciate I'll do it. For it. Three gil. Huh? Three I'm gil. A special discount right now on Toad King jobs. Looks like it's your lucky day. Awesome! Now that's my kind of bargain. The Toad King wants to take over our hideout. He's mean and angry really and smells bad too. So Will he find me? That's what it's called. Like my sword. Piece of cake. All right. <laughs> Enough. Let's go. That was the Toad King? Oh, okay. Leave this to me. I don't think so. Time to burn. Is that it? That fire is so powerful, man. Leave this to me. I don't think so. Get ready. <laughs> Was never in doubt. I've got this. Don't you mean we've got this? <laughs> That's it. That wasn't so bad. Punch through. Right, we gotta hurry. Get him! Now.
allow me. Toad King's definitely healing them, I think. We just had to pop all our damage cooldowns. Did you defeat the Toad King? Yep. Kicked his butt real good. Awesome! I knew you could do it! Now we don't have to worry about the King and his smelly friends! Thank you so much! Here, this is for you. The treasure Nailed we bought. It's definitely worth at least three gil. Okay, kids. Playtime's over for now. I've prepared a special Definitely assignment get tough for Caspi for sure. One that I expect you to finish today. Understood? Uh, yes. Yes, Miss Folia. I appreciate you getting rid of the Toad King, by the way. Wow, Miss Folia. You must know all their secrets. Oh, if only. Easier said than done. They're always on the move, looking for new adventures chasing new dreams all while trying to make the lives of everyone around them just a little bit better i try to make sure they don't stumble and fall and when they finally do i help them back up hmm. sounds exhausting <laughs> sometimes it is but i want the children to know that until they can stand on their own two feet that i'm here to support them care for them love them am i gonna play daisy we're, we're already playing related? daisy we're still a fan. Um, if you're asking if I'm playing a it today, I don't play games every in all day. The ways that matter. Um, if I can we do have that a rotation them, of games that we play through. Well, then maybe I'm making this world a better place. I know you are. My predecessor taught me everything I know. I just took up his torch and ran with it, I guess. Uh, not that I'm anything close to what he was. Biggs is one of a kind. <gasps> oh no! I've completely lost track of time! Do you have somewhere you need to be? Please, man. More like a dream I need to fulfill. Thank you again Ghost, for your how help. you doing? I wonder what kind of dream she's chasing tonight. Ghost, did you just compare me to Dr. Disrespect? Thanks like the doc? For saving her hideout for that man's a legend. In return, I let everyone know you guys can join the game as special guests. If you want to know more, then come to the hideout. What am I playing next? Uh, GTA Online will be tonight.
great if they asked us again. Gramps has been feeling a lot better ever since he heard about what happened. Uh, probably be around like seven, seven thirty Eastern Standard. Probably about two and a half hours or so from right now. We should be starting. Now that things are starting to settle down a bit, we can finally play Whack a Box again. It's all thanks to you. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's this tired-looking guy out by the community center, and I heard he was looking for some help. Cloud, you're just in time for our favorite game, Whack-A-Box. You want in? It's super fun. The rules are easy. The person who whacks the most boxes is crowned champion of the hideout. Bet. We usually don't let adults play, but since you're cool, we're gonna make a special exception just for you. I'm about to whack the shit out of these boxes. Okay. No holding back. Get ready. No holding back. Brace yourself. Get ready. the target score. Wow, Cloud! I've never seen anyone do that before! See? Pretty fun, right? Play with us again, Kay? That was actually quite fun. Oh, we just got a bunch of shit. It feels good to help people out, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you having fun yet? Heaps. Then you can't be afraid to show it more. Don't forget, it's all about service and salesmanship. I'll leave that to you. All right, but don't think you can rely on me forever, mister. Wasn't planning to. That's good. Cause I command a very good salary. So the nail bat's actually pretty decent.
And what and that's with no upgrades, guys. Oh, it doesn't have any material slots. Yeah, I see. I just don't. Can you get material slots with the upgrades? Let me see. Oh yeah, look at that right there. has a ton of crit, man. for a few seconds just to see how it hits. Putting on a big ass baseball bat. That's what's called easy I'm scared of the dying. It looks quite fun, but we'll have to see. Yeah, did I get other gear too? This one right here, Spectral Cog Wheel. Those might be upgrades for her. even have stats oh actually I might give this to her consuming MP fills the limit gauge that's really really good because for her we use her as a healer so we're constantly spamming out her MP so the more she uses MP she'll build towards her limit which is a bat big big mass heal so a little bit of synergy there
You're heading in already? Yeah, that's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry, we got a little sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Damn, she was pissed. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask, but would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? You boys made a trade, a normal life, for power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back! Good! Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? I've never been so proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. <laughs> you know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I wonder if there's really dudes in this world that are just act that cool, man. found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl that could keep you on the straight and narrow, and tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. Stay my welcome. Mama Duke's telling us to get the hell out. I mean, I don't want to sneak out, though. I mean, I say F the mom. I say F the mom, dude. Pacing in there? You hear it? Damn, there's the mom right there. You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Yeah? Please. Um, you got it. Thank you. Go upstairs and kick that fucking bucket. I'm sorry. That shit looks pretty damn good. Huh? 
Mom, lucky I didn't give her some of this baseball bat against her noggin. Who knew talking to the kids about the past? I mean, I wanted Eric to be a part of my party. Oh, uh, too slick. Well, look who it is. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. <laughs> Lead on then. With pleasure. <laughs> I'm going to be tight. Cloud? That's the downside to the soldier, right? They said Is something, something like the degradation, they die over time. It's nothing. see the sky they're still working on the new plate I don't like this part of Midgar back when they were still building Midgar there was an accident and the plate fell people had only just started moving in so there weren't a lot living there at the time but and that's the underside of Sector 6, Wall Market, a real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you? I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. Now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Want to see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid. Trying to bring us in the tunnel chat. Okay, it's not really the tunnel I was expecting. Uh, what would I eat? And the wife made um, some uh, cheeseburgers on the grill. Let's eat a homemade double cheese burger. You know, 
Ever since the plate fell. And there's no other way? It'll be an adventure. Oh, but this music, though. Get back. I can fight too, you know. I got this. Time to burn. Sure, swings on that bat. Like, at all. No. Makes you swing wicked, wicked slow. Thing to it. What's that? A big arm. Kind of cute, don't you think? Uh. Someone's pulled up the ladder. I wonder if we can use this. Give me a ride. You serious? Not Absolutely. Just I'll throw down the ladder well, for like you to climb up after. like five feet off the ground. What do you mean? Like. <laughs> Should have been able to just jump up there, lady. You did it. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Hmm. All right. Good enough. Let's keep on trucking. Hmm. Stop. Did we wake it up?
I don't even know what this music is. There's like two ways I could have went. Looks like a dead end. Yeah, so we can use the control up top to move this. Grab that container with the arm. Not half bad. So, do you moonlight as a crane operator or something? I'm gonna stay leaving her hanging, bro. <laughs>
Eric with the five. Thank you so much, brother. Favorite streamer of all time. I really appreciate that, Eric. Seriously, man. Hmm. Hold on a second. Gotcha. Perfect. Cloud, over here. Whoa, not too fast, okay? Got it. I don't know why. I can see something you guys saw in that game about that game, Dino Crisis. Stuff like that sounds so familiar to me. Did that game have tank controls like Resident Evil? It's like Resident Evil with zombies in it or dinosaurs. I remember that game as a kid. I didn't play it. I think I had a friend who owned it. And I watched him. Anybody around? Guess it's just us. Hmm. It's still warm. Should we relight it? Have our own campfire? I need to get back. Besides, looky here, boys! Caught us some burglars! Coming into our homes and stealing our shit? Doing crimes? <laughs> I'd say we're owed compensatory damages! <laughs> Kept them in a composite. I don't get it! Ah, how stupid can you be? It's crazy simple! <laughs> compensatory damages is like, uh, it's like compensation. For damages! Oh yeah! <laughs> That's what you get when you... Uh, when somebody else... We uh, haven't done anything wrong. Yeah, we were just passing through. Oh, a likely story! <laughs> okay, what do you want? Nothing but our due recompense, that's all. <laughs> due recompense, due recompense, due, due recompense. Uh, no shit for brains, due recompense. It's like, uh, uh it's like, uh, 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 they're gonna wreck my pants? Compensatory damages. Um, of course, so damages, recompense. I, as simple as that. I think we've heard enough. Stay back! Anytime! Come on! Oh, come on, come on, come on! Here goes! Here! You will! You can do it! Let's do this! <laughs> No. Okay, guys, whatever you do, don't move. Don't look. Don't look. 
I'm dead. I'm super dead. Caspi, that was the hard part you were talking about, bro? Didn't seem that bad. Shit! Let's get the hell out of here! Who are you guys? Don't leave me! I'm coming! Random question, but why did you quit being a soldier? That is random. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Oh. Um, did you have any soldier friends? Any war buddies? No. Not really. Oh, okay. Huh? What we got here? All right. Fresh meat and test drive. So long. So it's my turn? I'd keep my distance if I were you. Go on! Can you take over for me? Just go away! Charge of the arm. Got it? George with the gifted brother. Thank you, thank you, man. If you haven't seen uh, Ark in 10 days, that means you're not following me on my second channel.
That was Magnify right there. My question, is it a good offensive or like, should I use it on my healer? Should I use it on Cloud for damage? I'm not going to do the rest of the Titans on second channel. I'm going to do the, uh, I'm just doing the prep for on the second channel. Uh, I'll be doing Desert Titan on the main channel here. And same thing with, um, same thing with the, uh, King Titan. But, uh, I was thinking about going to, like, Falagro and getting some of these, getting some dinos over there. So I messed up. I needed to leave that space on the ground there available for me to move this. But um, the question I was asking myself whether I wanted to do that on the main channel, like when I go to Largo and get those like feathered raptors and shit. <sighs> so now what I'll do is I'll grab this. All right. Throw this one up top. This one. Oh, okay. Never mind. So I did have it right, guys. So you could stack them on top of each other. Yeah, this music isn't the greatest. Like 99% of the music in this game has been pretty phenomenal. This song's a little... Don't make me crazy. Song is the best song. I wouldn't say that. It was okay, you know, the first 30 minutes I was listening to it. Oh, me. 
a sec. All right, cool. Hurry. At least it's like elevating each time, you know? Getting little uh, different sound effects. Like one of them songs, they add a little bit to it. That went pretty well. Sure did. Uh, damn, bro. Huh? Wait a minute. Did you just. Nope. Nope. Don't worry. We'll be on the same page next time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, okay? I mean, you left her hanging like 20 times, Cloud. What do you expect, bro? Hold it right there, lovebirds! If you want to pass through our territory, then you gotta pay the toll! No holding back. This motherfucker's stealing tons of money. Dude. One more shot. Go on. That's bad. We made it. Smell the fresh air. Oh, Floppy Brother with the raid, man. How you doing tonight, bro? Everybody who came over, hey, thank you so much. I appreciate the love, guys. We're over here vibing big time with the song. This. All right, there it is. The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. <laughs> I don't have time. Up for there looks nice. <sighs> Come on. <laughs> you know, a long time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh, yeah? Your first class, right? Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? I probably know him. to do that wow uh, your eyes oh it's cuz of the mako all soldiers have them yeah i know sorry i'm bumming you out but again floppy go. floppy team hey, i appreciate you guys for being here man it means a lot to me so she loved, I guarantee she loved that dude that's Not trying back. to fight us. Or the ghost dude that we keep seeing. Sephiroth, or what the hell's the name? Sep. Better with an S.
can't, we can't not do this. That part of the that's what I thought it was The Seth Meister. That's what we'll call him. That's a cool name. Here. Hmm. This won't take long. Get to Sector 7 in style? This is the passageway for you. So <laughs> go ahead. Listen, I got I got a lady, man. You gonna be okay getting home? And if I said I wasn't? I'll go with you. I thought you needed to get back. <laughs> Don't worry. I have a backup route for emergencies, and it's safer, too. <laughs> Damn. Again, she left the party. It's like when Eleven left the party. Lost their mage, you know what I mean? Only the real ones in the chat know what that what I mean by that. We're about to lose our we're about to lose the mage of our party chat. We're gonna have to replace her with a damn zoomer. Guess this is it then. Ready? Yeah. Lost you. What's going on? Shh. I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick. The Thief Meister. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And Is that really the exotic again? outfit I asked a her to wear? filled with his goons. Wait, I thought she was supposed to wear it for us. you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Come on, Cloud. We got to hurry. I've been loyal, chat. This whole time. Being the good guy, the loyal guy gets you.
Hey where's she at, bro? Hey there. Where are you headed? You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Right, let's put the Can't knife. See, let's I'm put the sword to his work. neck. Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's it's Arthur your story? Morgan looking ass? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl here? Guess. We want to save. Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well, he just had her five minutes, like two seconds ago, bro. She's in great shape. Is that really important? Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? What are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. Uh, and there goes our best lead yet. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. And how, how hard could it be? It's obviously going to be the freaking big... answer looking place, isn't it? Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that that's got Poon everything Tang juice? for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little stretch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. Oh, platoon juice. I was like, what the fuck? Mm. This delivery isn't due for inspection. Huh? These ones addressed to Don Corneo? Yes, it is. Would you look at you guys? You do. Yes, you. Do you have a place to stay this enchanted evening? We have the perfect room for a sweet looking couple like you. How much? <laughs> Just give me a holler when you change your mind. That's easy. Anywhere with a bunch of Do we not need a place to s Oh! Oh, is that a love motel? Oh, got it. Track. My bad. I wasn't trying to. Maybe it's broken? Welcome to the world of tomorrow. Any item you can think of, just a button push away. Look, there it is. Material. Take a look, see. This is my fight. Relaxation, the sweet embrace of pretty lady popcorn here. Uh, to enter or not to enter, that is the question. Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? <laughs> I knew it! 
Let me guess. After you've had your fun, you fall into a spiral of shame and self-loathing. But it only lasts a moment, doesn't it? Next thing you know, you're right back here again. Huh? Got a question for me? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Oh god, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her. <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny. Your Tifa needs you. Tifa, I'm coming, baby! Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. My apologies, sir. We are not ready to open at this time. Really clean enough. What? Does that look like the teacher? From her town, the, the town we were just in? Uh, aren't you that leaf house? It is! Uh, hey, what the hell, Merc? It is! <laughs> Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. <laughs> What are you doing here? Hey, well, she got that side you gig. Must know, I've wanted to be a dancer ever since I was a little girl. I come here at night to live the dream. <laughs> I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? Hey, now we know where that donation money's coming from that the kids are talking about. Gotta stay sharp, though. Lifetime bands are lifetime bands. Hey, I heard you used to be a honey ball baby. This man, uh, give it to me, please. Come back in the Oh, let me check out that material now that we just got. That's linked to my fire spell now. Uh, that scent. I can't stand it. Who tank juice, dude? He's not he's not seasoned yet. Yeah, see, obviously, it's that place. So this area is in the original game. I couldn't imagine what this would look like on, like, PlayStation 1. Like, did it look this epic on PlayStation 1? Market's premier weapon shop. So he's just got all the guns. Oh, Art Edge. The only problem is this: this weapon has like monster attack, right? 
but it loses all magic damage and all defense. Not worth it. Do come again. Just thinking about getting it for that ability, though. Welcome, come on in. Take a look. Take a look. We'll buy it for the ability. Thank you. I hope to see you again soon. George with the super chat, brother. Thank you so much, man. Uh, how do you balance paying attention to what's happening in the game versus what's happening in chat? Trickier than it seems as a regular. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I'm still trying to master it to this day, George. I just kind of, um, I try to prioritize gameplay, especially in story games. I think we might have found our man, and he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Uh, depending on it, all depends on the type of game we're playing. You know, if it's a very story-driven game, I try to focus more on the the story because the last thing people want is me sitting here talking during cutscenes and stuff like that. So, um, kind of all just depends, really. Uh, but I'm not. I, I wouldn't say I'm perfect at it by any means. I'm still still trying to master it myself. You know what I mean? Well, thank you, brother, for the super chat, man. I appreciate it. She did it again. She threw her skirt over her head. It's definitely lasting longer than the last one did. All right, they can't stop us, chat. Let's bring up this mini map here. What's happening, chat? <laughs> I might be missing some textures. Not so fast. There we buddy. go. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah. So? So people can't just walk through the Feels weird to see door. stuff after seeing Especially white men. for so long. How about me then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute. Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on. Can't you help us out? 
Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. If you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Guys, thank you again. We got over 400 likes on the stream. I really do appreciate it. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got like how close ideas. we talking, Caspi? Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. Chocobo, dude. We talked to him <laughs> when we first came in. Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, hear us out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around. I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Already recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. Which one, chat? Heads or tails? When in doubt, tails it out. That's what I say. No deal. Just, nah, dude. Tails never fails. Yeah, he could be using one of them, them double sided coins, man. He's a cheater. No thanks. Oh, not a gambler, huh? convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, and not just a meal. Now skip battle. 
wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. My impression of that guy? That dude seems like a badass. right now why don't we try looking for another one of the trio See Andrea. Let me handle this. You wait out here, okay? Then why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that. You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required. And the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years? All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry. But there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Andrea shows transcend beauty and taste. They're feeling so good. This is gonna be amazing. Here we go again. Well, this isn't working out. Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm -hmm. We are a hand massage parlor. An the hand massages are absolute legend status. Terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... 
hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don Cook. Oh, Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Mm. Uh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... Hmm. Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? Yeah, we're going with that luxury course like a baller. <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back. And wait. Cloud? <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well-to-do patrons. Oh, wait. What did I buy, chat? First, the hand cream. A generous coating for each what did I buy, and every one on. of your richly deserving fingers. Let's start with the tips. That's it. Relax. I'm only here to help. Oh, did that hurt? No. <laughs> then I'll move on to the base. Of the fingers. Let's see if we can't improve your circulation and get that blood flowing. <laughs> no, don't fight it. Stress is poison to the body. And finally, some gentle stimulation for the palm. No more than a touch. Just like this. Oh, what was that? A cry of pleasure? How you like it? How about this? Or maybe this? <laughs> if that was to your liking, do come again. Right. How was it? Huh? Best 3,000 my man's ever. Yo, he. You okay? Yeah. You're acting weird, Cloud. I am? Really weird. Hmm. Think you'll make a habit of it? I think I've seen everything I need to see. So? Tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. God, thank you so much for the super set. <laughs> I paid for it too. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm? Okay. Really? But you cannot go dressed like that. Huh? I could never send Carneo a candidate wearing such a plain looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It's comfortable, isn't it? Cloud the fashion critic. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. 
So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gil. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. A million gil? But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes. For the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. We really gotta just do a stupid fight thing to get her a dress. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think we can win it all? That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. I appreciate the confidence, just don't get too cocky, okay? What do you mean? It's not even like they're freaking soldiers or anything. But where do we go? It doesn't even show me. Something to do. Pete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? team. Yes, is this the part no, you're talking about, me. bro? Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. You're having a hard time fighting for a dress, right. bro? Team it is. Come on, Caspi. down below. does this thing go you think I wonder how many people are fighting hey you're not nervous are you nope really you're even more quiet than usual the hand massage. just trying to focus like you should
<laughs> uh, it's not your turn yet. Your names will be announced over the speaker. Just wait until then. Oh, <laughs> you again. Damn, Johnny. Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know. So I signed up for the preliminaries and, well, I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aaron, your match will begin shortly. Oh, here we go, Please guys. make your way to the gate. We're in way too deep to back out now. You two ready? Try not to get yourselves killed. For our next match, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talk about a bad day! Well, this is their first tournament, the bad first date, and most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! <laughs> Now I'm mad. Zero. What if Walmart is sold? I'm now I'm mad. Now I'm mad. 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 I'm don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah. Wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. Well, that was some bullshit. Cloud and Aerith. Your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. That's what they call beginner's luck. But the next match won't be so easy. Ready to rock? Just remember, try not to die. For the second match in our spectacular semifinals, fresh from their first date with death, I present the Lucky Couple! We're like unlucky for the rest of us! Give it up once again for Cloud and Eren! Couple my ass! What the hell you two trying to pull? You assholes cost me a fortune! Yeah, yeah! Their opponents, the Reavers of this backyard, thieves and killers through and through! Too criminal for common criminals, the worst of the worst! <laughs> 
Ladies and gentlemen, check your pockets because they may have already robbed you blind. The most contemptible son of bitch in this town of Walmart gets best benefit. of the Corneo Cup semi-finals. Begin now! Hey, when I get stunned like that... Here goes! You can do it!
It was two against, uh, I don't remember how many exactly, but a lot. But somehow the winners of our match are... Once again, Cloud and Aaron! That kid's really something. Well, of course he is. I did give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. Hmm. So have half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. Call it. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going to run out. When I fall from grace, maybe I'll land in your parlor once more. <clears throat> that is one mistake I will never repeat. <laughs> you gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing! Andy! <sighs> Next up, the big finale. Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Oh, so we get a bench in here. Cloud and Aerith. The final match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. You proved me wrong. You guys are pretty good. It's the final match. You good to go? As long as it's not as annoying as that last one, we'll be fine, on guys. Win it for me. Ladies and gentlemen, our time together is almost over. Tonight's thrilling Corneo Cup, filled with unprecedented upsets and drama, has only one match to go. <laughs> we know. We're just as disappointed as you are. But ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end. So let's celebrate by getting so damn loud, they'll hear us up on the fly! Yeah! Come on! Once more, the sweethearts who surprised us with upset after spectacular upset. The power couple with the boundless love for bloodshed. The champions of Madame M, Cloud and Eric! Yeah! Come on now! Come on! Who can do better than that? And now, five time winners of the Corneo Cup! Murder machines with countless kills to their name, along with a handful of maimings. The deadly duo that takes up the trash with a vengeance. The electric executioners, Chocobo Sam's champions, Cuddy and Sleepy. Come on. Robots. More like.
Shinra armor. More like cheating. <laughs> Who will walk away with the one million kill prize? Get ready for it by guarantee to go down in history. The final match of the Corneo Cup begins now. Taking this rather well. I was looking forward to a little temper tantrum. You bet it all on a toss. Sometimes you get burned by Lady Luck. Every coin has two sides. You're right, of course. Even if they are both the same. <laughs> Later. And now. I believe I have a prize to collect. Sorry. The madam will have to wait. The Don's demanding that we tack on one more match, it seems. What? If they win out, then you get paid in full. Now hold on just a goddamn minute! I knew that was too easy. This call, not mine. <laughs> now that that's over, we can go save Tifa. So we'll head back to Madam M's, get you changed, and then it's off to Corneo's. Right. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news. But you still have one fight left. What do you mean? The crowd loved your show a little too much. People are placing hefty bets, much heftier than you can possibly imagine. Corneo's going to milk this for as much as he can. Meaning what? You face and defeat Corneo's fighter of choice, and only then will you be declared winners of the tournament. Hey, that wasn't the deal! Don't you think I know that?! Ah! You greedy bastard! Scum-sucking piece of shit-festering asshole! Uh... <sighs> but that's the way it is. Corneo's the one who makes the rules around here. But if you win this match, Corneo will have to accept your victory. And the crowd will make sure he does. So this is the last one? I sure hope so. They've been surprisingly easy at this point. Second fight was probably the worst so far. Watching you guys fight gave me goosebumps. Hope your next match is even better than the last. Ready to kick ass? Me too, bro. 
It's not even about the money anymore, man. I just want you guys to win it all. Show them what you got. Tonight's Corneo Cup has been a spectacle like no other. And we shared your disappointment, ladies and gentlemen, when we told you that it was coming to an end. But nobody felt it more keenly than one time Corneo, who has decided that a bonus match is in order. I'm already stocked up, dude. I haven't used anything. Participating in this match will be this evening's leading lights, the dynamic duo that has crossed all competition thus far. Crow and Aaron! Buried in the bowels of the Coliseum. An unspeakable horror, long in prison, set free tonight for your entertainment! The secret star of Don Cuneo's stellar stable! Enter the Hell House!
and gentlemen. What the? Look out! Tagging out. Pay attention. We dare you. We jump down. Okay. Oh, 
heroic move by Eren, as she provides support for her partner. Save that gear, Ingwin. Let it wash over you, restore you inside and out. Is ice for fire, lightning to wind. So is it wind? Is wind when it's green? Well, it's God mode. We can't hurt it at all.
cheers to Eric is breaking down barriers and handling me! And when it's robot like this, use lightning. the song.
Awfully rare you showing an interest in someone. What will you do? <laughs> oh, that was a good fight, man. That was some Elden Ring shit right there. There you are. I've been looking for you two. So Madam M wanted me to give you a message. She says you guys did pretty damn good, and that you should swing by her shop when you're done here. Got it? I was also hoping you might be interested in a few more matches here at the Coliseum. Big events like the Corneo Cup are pretty sporadic, but there's always action if you want to get a piece. Uh, items cannot be used during battles, but HP and MP are slightly restored after each fight. That's dope. I wouldn't mind trying a couple of those. But it's all guys, we gotta save and we're gonna uh we're gonna end this episode here. There it is. So we got it in, guys. We got it in. Went a little over on that, but it's all good. We had to get that that done. Oh, uh, that was that was a good good fight for sure. Uh, but thank you guys again. I, I do appreciate all the love and support you guys have been showing this series so far. Uh, remember, if you guys want more Final Fantasy in the future, I just smash that like button. It's the best way to let me know if you guys are actually enjoying it. Um, and if you guys are new to the channel, like, consider subscribing. So we'll be doing one more stream here um, and a few. We'll be playing some GTA. Uh, so again, guys, thank you so much. Uh, if I don't see you in the next stream, you have a great rest of your night. Castro, you weren't lying, brother. I'm pretty sure now that you're probably just going to go and smash it out yourself, dude. But there it is, guys. So again, thank you so much. Uh, guys, have a great rest of your night. If I don't see you in the next one, and for everybody else, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.